What is going on, guys? Kai here at Golf Auto Direct in Waveland, Mississippi, for you the 2023 GMC Acadia in white with only 14,000 miles. Guys, I just want to send you a quick walk around video of the vehicle, show you this here on the lot. We're going to go over some of the features and benefits. So, starting off here at the back, guys, just to get right into it. Most keys in the car industry, especially used cars, is going to be one key. Actually, specifically into the used car industry, it's going to be one key, guys. If you have a second one, consider yourself lucky on this particular vehicle. I do have a second key, so let's hop right in. So we have the lock and unlock. We have access to the trunk via the key fob and the remote start. Now, the, the back of the vehicle won't always open. In this case, it would gain access to the vehicle because the vehicle is running. Right back here, very nice upholstery, guys. Right under here, we do have a little cargo area. We do have the tow hitch skirt right down here. It does all have all the hookups in the back. Um, there is no actual tow hitch um, applied to the vehicle, would need to be applied. Um, but you do have all the hookups down there guys. We do have a 12 volt 180 watt outlet access to release the third row and I'm gonna pull these up guys so we can see them from the front of the vehicle. But just to give you a quick little preview, the, the interior is immaculate. It's all leather, no cracking, no issues whatsoever. So we'll drop this down, move around left hand side of the vehicle guys, wrap around taillights, highly rated and safety, aluminum alloy rim set, good tread on the tires guys. No scratches, bumps, or bruises down the left-hand side of the vehicle. You can see we have a privacy tint package on this vehicle. That's no tint in the front, mid-grade in the middle, highest degree here in the back. Keyless entry on all the doors. Nice chrome accenting on that Denali Insignia right down there. Again, no major curb scratch. Looks like there's a little bit of curbing right here, guys. Uh, very superficial, though, as I rub my hand across it. Doesn't give much texture. No cracks in the windshield. No scuffs, bumps, or bruises on the front of the hood here, as you can see. And then here in the front, guys, we got triple LEDs on both sides, all chrome front bumper. We have all of our sensors right down here as well. Moving around the right-hand side of the vehicle, guys, same song and dance. You can see no scratches, no bumps, no bruises, no dents, no rusting whatsoever. And check out those two rims. This one looks fantastic, guys. No curb scratch whatsoever. Again, really nice tread on those tires. And then here in the front, Looks like we have a little nick here, but again, guys, most of this stuff's superficial, no cracking. Uh, the, the, the rim doesn't seem to need to be replaced, otherwise it would have split pretty hard down into the back and caused some pretty rough rides. So let's check out this back seat, guys, hopping in right here on the right-hand side of the vehicle. You can see it's an all-leather interior, absolutely immaculate at 14,000 miles. We've got the wood trim in on the door handles here. I like to push on these guys as at 6'3", six, six, 210 pounds. If, it's, if the door panel comes off from me pushing on it, there's a problem. But if it doesn't, we're in pretty good standing. Right back here, you can see we do have mats, guys. There is that third row again in perfect condition. No damage whatsoever to any of the seats, any of the upholstery. We've got an inverter back here, so you could charge your uh, laptop, micro USB-C for your phone, and then a USB for anything else. We've got heated seats back here as well, guys, and our own AC controls. So let's hop into the front seat, guys. Confirm those miles, and we will go from there. Guys, you can see you got automated seats here. We got automated doors and windows and some seat settings. We also have access to the trunk here. Hopping into the vehicle, you can see on the dash, 13,677 miles, guys. A whole thousand miles lower than we expected. We've got heated steering. We've got distance monitoring. We got hands-free talk to text. Over here, we got our automated parking brake. Information on display for our HUD. We've got information um, for, let's see what this one is. Ah, we have information for a heads-up display, and you guys can't even see that in there, but I'm out of you go. I'm actually looking at the display on my screen here. Super cool. I don't see those very often in these vehicles. Right down here, guys, all wood grain. We've got heated seats. We've got cooled seats, ventilated seats. We've got two-wheel drive. We've got four-wheel drive. We've got um, a sport mode, and then we have an off-road mode. Uh, parking, uh, uh, we have uh, parking sensors here in the back. We can turn those off, guys, in case you want to tow up to something um, on your tow hitch. Our traction control, our stop-start feature. We have a charging station here as well with a USB, micro USB-C, and another 180-watt outlet. Guys, this vehicle is fully loaded. Let's check it out. Bam, built-in navigation. Yeah, this is a high package in this 
um, in this GMC. Typically, you do not have the ventilated seats. You do not have the charging station. And usually, with a screen display this size, you would only have the Apple CarPlay or the Android Auto. So this is absolutely fully loaded. The AC runs real good. Let's see. The radio works, guys. Leather wrap center console. Nice deep well right down here in the glove box. Doesn't look like there's an owner's manual in there. So keep that in mind, guys. But I'm going to give this vehicle 10 out of 10. It's fully loaded. It's got under 15,000 miles. It's got two keys. I don't know what else you could really ask for in a vehicle, especially at this price point. Uh, full manufacturer's warranty and everything, guys. No brace of smells. No discoloration. Um, it looks and smells perfect. So again, guys, Kai here at Golf Auto Direct in Waveland, Mississippi. If you have any questions or concerns or you guys just want to uh, chat a little bit, you can reach out to me here at the dealership. But if we're already communicating, you guys can always reach out to me in the text thread where we are communicating, and I'd be happy to answer any questions or concerns that way. Guys, I hope you have a fantastic day, and I look forward to earning your business. Uh, please let me know if there's anything that I can do for you guys, and I will be here. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.